How's it going guys? Today I want to cover a subject that I often get from my viewers, my subscribers, um, either in my comments, my Instagram DMs, or even in the coaching calls sometimes. And it always revolves around the idea of the fear of signing your first client. So for some people, it might be the fear of starting to cold call. Others, it might be the sales meeting. So actually closing people over Zoom. Um, others, it might be collecting payment. Others, doing the, the service delivery in itself. So just like overall, in general, the fear of signing your first client. So today I'm going to be sharing like what exactly I did to get over this initial bump, this initial fear, and how you guys can pretty much just replicate what I did. And hopefully it can help you just overcome this little hard period because if, if you guys have been following me like for a while, you know that I often say that the first client that you sign is absolutely the hardest thing you're going to be doing in this whole entire agency thing. Okay, It's easier for someone who's making 10 grand to set themselves a challenge to make 100 grand per month than it is for someone who's just starting and has no idea what they're doing. I really believe that just signing your first client will be the hardest thing in your entire SMA journey or agency journey in general. So I'm going to share a story with you guys, okay? And I think that this story will explain it a bit better than if I just lay out exactly what to do because you guys won't really understand what I'm trying to explain to you. So I, like this summer, I took a door-to-door -door sales job. So I, I basically took that job to learn how to sell because like you guys, I had the fear of selling to people. That was like basically my biggest fear. It wasn't actually doing the service delivery and stuff like that. For me, it was the cold calling and also the fear of like, oh my God, like I'm going to be with someone on a Zoom call, like a business owner, like a real adult, you know, they have a business and I'm trying to pitch them something that's worth a couple of, a service that's a couple of thousand dollars per month. And that really scared me. So I said to myself, I'm like, okay, let's just learn how to sell. And maybe afterwards, it's going to be a lot easier for me to do this entire process. So I took the summer job, door to door sales, and I really wanted to be prepared for this job. So I read a bunch of books. I watched a bunch of videos and no matter how much content I consumed, I was still as nervous as I was like when I first applied for the job. Let's say on a scale of one to 10, 10 being the super stressed, I was still a 10. No matter how much content I consumed, I was still as nervous as I was when I started out. And I think you guys are in a similar situation. Okay. You're watching people doing like sales videos. You're watching my videos, but you're still nervous about signing your first client. Right. So when the summer started, we had basically like a day of full training. So we basically worked with people who previously door knocked, who had very good results and they knew what they were doing. And they basically gave us a basic training one on one on how to sell door to door knocking. And although these people were my colleagues, I saw them as my mentors. They basically taught me everything that I needed to know in order to be successful door knocking, selling door to door knocking. And by having someone who knew exactly how the process worked that removes so much stress in this like whole process because every like little fear of unknown that i had i could just refer myself to them and they would explain to me exactly how the process worked and it just took this huge load off my shoulders like at first i was scared of like okay how does how do you actually sell psycho someone like how what's the process of like someone who has no idea who you are and then at the end they actually buy your service like what's that process like they explained to me exactly we role play together i learned everything i'm like oh okay that's not too bad so by having a mentor by having someone who really like held my hand and taught me everything about selling door-to-door -door knocking that took my stress from like a 10 to i wouldn't say a zero but let's say a six six or five i was still very stressed but a lot less than i was before because I knew more or less how the whole process worked. But now what I was lacking is the actual experience, like actually doing it for myself. So basically the first tip that I'm giving you guys is to work with someone who has done it before in the past and who can basically teach you all of the little processes that go in starting an agency. All right. How do you take a complete stranger and make them give you their credit card information and buy your service? How does this process work? The only way you're going to find that out is by working with someone who knows what they're doing. My second tip is very simple. The only way you're going to get over the fear of unknown is by actually doing the thing. It's simple as that. I like to use the example of driving a car. When you first drove a car, you were super nervous. You had no idea what you were doing. You were scared of hitting someone, of crashing a car, of not being good. Okay, there was a bunch of things running through your mind because you had absolutely no idea what you were doing and you were just starting out. 
okay, no matter how many videos of how to drive a car or the courses you took, like the teacher who basically wrote on the board, like all of these things you're supposed to remember when you're driving, until you actually drive the car for yourself, you're gonna be, you're still gonna have this high level of stress. But now when you drive, you're blasting the music, you're speeding, you're having full-on conversations with people, and you can still drive more or less uh, with, with confidence. All right, and the only reason why you can do that is because you put in the hours and you practiced how to drive. For you now driving, it's like it's it's something that's super easy for you to do. You can be half asleep, and you can still drive correctly, because you have the experience, you have the knowledge. So this is the exact same thing with this whole agency thing. The more cold calls you do, the better you're going to be at it. The more your your stress level is going to go down. The more sales meetings you take the more your stress level is gonna go down. So instead of just being so scared that, oh, I'm gonna practice, I'm gonna watch videos on how to cold call, forget all of those things and just start cold calling. That's the only way you're gonna reduce your stress level. And that was the exact, like I was in the exact same position when I started door knocking. My stress went from a 10, my mentor brought it down to, let's say a six. I got into my neighborhood and it took me like a good 20 minutes to just hype myself up to go knock my first door. I knocked it. It went okay. I was like, huh, this isn't too bad. And my stress went from a six to a five. I knocked a couple of doors. I understood more or less how the process worked. I'm like, oh, okay, this is, it's not that bad. So now my stress went down even further. And then afterwards, when I actually signed my first client, and now I understood the full process of someone who has no idea who you are, to get them giving you your credit card and signing on with you. Once I had this entire process done, my stress went from a five to like a two because now I knew everything I had to know in order to sign my first client. How do you get over this initial fear of signing your first client? I would personally work with a mentor, have them teach you the entire process of doing a cold call to signing your client to delivering the service delivery so that you can know more or less how this whole process works. And the only way you can really learn in depth how it works is by learning by someone who has done it in the past. Okay, so that's gonna help reduce stress levels. Once you do that, the second part is to just actually do it. Do the thing that you're stressed, you're stressed about. If you're stressed about cold calling, you start cold calling. If it's sales meetings, once you get into sales meetings, the more you do, the better you're gonna be at. It's the fear of unknown that's holding you guys back, and it's the reason why you're not being successful right now. All right, so just understand, like a car, the more I practice, the better I'm gonna be at it, and the easier it is gonna be for me to actually do the thing that I'm trying to do. So I hope this video was useful. Um, if ever you guys are looking for a mentor, a one-on-one -on -one coach that can help you, I am offering that service. Um, otherwise, I wish you the very best in your journey, in your SSMA, your agency, and uh, we'll see each other on the next video. Bye-bye.